Hi everyone, I'm your Kasturi Krishnan and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to review a TikTok famous cleaning product which is the Pink Stuff. Here is the Pink Stuff paste that have been going viral on TikTok and Instagram recently and today I thought of giving it a try. I got to know that Pink Stuff actually exists for so many years but this product actually became very famous in TikTok and Instagram where people shared a lot of videos cleaning their toughest stain on any pot. Let's see if this Pink Stuff can actually remove the toughest stain that I have in my house on my pot today. Before going into the review, let's have a look at their packaging. Their packaging itself says that it's tough on stains and it's a miracle cleaning paste. That's what everyone claims on social media as well. They also say that it contains 99% of natural ingredient and it's environmentally non-toxic, non-hazardous formulation and not tested on animals. Basically, it's a vegan product. Let's go and have a look if it really works for me or not. First of all, let's open the product and see how it looks inside. There's a seal here. I'm going to break this. Oh, just like that. <laughs> so, let's open and see how it looks. Mm. I don't know why it smells like strawberry or raspberry. <sighs> smells good. Okay, so this is how it looks. I hope you guys can see how it looks. Just like their name, it really looks pink in color. It's a pink paste. I just can't stop smelling this. You know, usually the powerful cleaning products, they have a very strong or like very bad smell. But... This one is an exceptional for me. It smells really good. It smells like a raspberry smoothie. <laughs> now, let's put this pink paste on a test and see if it really lives up to its promises. The most important thing that we need to know is how to apply this on a pot. So, I read through the direction earlier. It basically says that apply using a soft cloth or sponge and rinse it off with hot water. For me personally, this is so easy to use as what I just told you guys just have to apply this using a sponge and wash it with hot water very simple as that I hope you all would have watched my previous pongal video if you all never watch it please go and watch it in that pongal video I actually used the stainless steel pot directly on burning firewood and this is the result and this is so embarrassing to show but yeah this is how it looks like now and you all can see here you know it's half clean meaning i already cleaned this with so many products i almost gave up on this pot actually you know i tried almost every method and everything failed and recently i went to poundland and i came across pink stuff which was only 150 1 pound 50p and for me, it was a good price and I thought of buying it and giving it a try. And today, let's do this together. Let's check if it really cleans tougher stains like this one here. Since we want to know whether the pink stuff really works or not, I thought of applying the pink stuff only on half of the pot so that later we can compare the before and also the after of pink stuff, if that makes sense. I have a brand new scrub here which I bought from Poundland as well. Let's go ahead and apply the pink stuff on half of the pot now. I think I need a spoon for this. It's a very thick paste. Okay, I have a spoon here. Let's just scoop it and put it on the pot. See, it's a very thick paste. If you all can see. I'm amazed with the thickness of the paste. It looks more like a smoothie, I would say. See, this is how it looks like. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put this on my pot now. And let's scrub half of the pot with our pink stuff. I better hold half of this.
maybe you all can see on this side it's really really dark I'm still not sure if this thing gonna work or not okay let's let's get generous a bit and put more so I'm gonna apply thoroughly on all the stains A bit more. Can I my baju? I don't want to scrub it at the moment. I just want to apply the paste thoroughly and leave it for some time. Okay, that's it. So I already applied the paste on half of the pot, as you all can see here. This half here is still black in color and this half is where I applied my pink stuff paste. I'm going to leave this for 10 minutes. Of course the direction didn't say that. The direction basically just says that just apply and scrub it and wash it under hot water. But I am being an Asian here. <laughs> I want to leave this on for 10 minutes and then start scrubbing it. 10 minutes later. Okay guys. I have left this pink stuff paste on the pot for more than 10 minutes actually. I'm going to give it a scrub before washing it under hot water for better result. Oh, I can already see the result. I can definitely see the result already. Uh, let's not get excited first. Uh, let me scrub the whole pot and then we will see the result. Okay. Okay, I already give it a good scrub and this is how it looks. Uh, the pink stuff has become a grey stuff <laughs> because of my black colour pot. And now I'm going to wash it under hot water and let's see how it looks. Finally, it's the time to wash my pot. It's already looking good on this side. Now I'm just going to rinse it under hot water. One good thing in my house, the sink already have hot water option. So I'm just going to give it a rinse here. Let's... uh. Let's see how it works. Well, it's really hot. So I can't really touch it. Wow. Just look at the difference on the both sides. So this is the side where I applied the paste and this is the dirty side. Look at the difference. It's, it's amazing. It, it looks almost like a brand new pot on this side. And look at all the tough stains on the other side. I don't usually give very high rating on product, but look at this. This much difference is crazy. I definitely recommend this to all of you. I love how easy it is to use. You just have to apply it on the stubborn stain, let it sit for a few minutes, scrub it using a scrub and just wash it under hot water. It's so easy to use. And look at the difference. There we go. Pink stuff really lived up to its promises. It did an amazing job on my pot. Thank you for watching my video. If you enjoyed watching this video, don't forget to like the video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want more cleaning tips, travel tips, food reviews and so on. Until I see you guys again, thank you and bye-bye.